Hi, my name is James Kellaway. I'm the Energy Intelligence Manager here at National Grid ESO. I've got a really great remit here. We work with um, top tier data scientists across the world um, and we use brand new cutting edge techniques um, based around artificial intelligence and data science uh, to essentially make sure that our grid can operate in a, in a carbon free or low carbon way moving forward. So what does that actually mean? Um, we are um, facing probably one of the biggest challenges that human beings have ever faced in terms of climate change. We are the first generation to fully understand the impact that we've had on our climate and we're probably the last that can do something about it. The team I lead here at the National Grid ESO um, are a lab that specialises in with data science in enabling tools and artificial intelligence to go into this environment here behind us to effectively enable us to operate the grid with a zero carbon capability by 2025. I began my career very differently than many of the engineers that work here. Uh, one of the things that we really value here is diversity. So myself, uh, I actually programmed my first computer when I was six years old. Um, when I was a student, I did a couple of degrees in classical music. I learned to conduct a symphony orchestra. I then had uh, 20 years in the software industry because it was fun. And now I get a really cool job here, which is Energy Intelligence Manager at the ESO, leading um, a really diverse and really great group of data scientists. Having this broad set of skills uh, is really useful when you're working with some really great people. Uh, we've done a number of initiatives that I'm brightly proud of as, as ESO. One of those is the Carbon Intensity Initiative. We were approached about a year and a half ago to say, how do you actually measure accurately the amount of carbon that the electricity generation fleet produces? We set up a prototype concept for that, um, and I'm proud to say that as of last month, that had 4.7 million hits. That was across industry, that so across automotive, across heat batteries, um, pretty much anywhere where people use power, they can access this data for free at any time they wish. One of the ways that we've taken this to the consumer level is to enable this through an app. So we have an app which is available through the App Store um, and also through the Android Play Store. And this tells anyone who wants to know it, effectively, when's the cleanest time to use power? My proudest moment at the ESO to date was when we launched Carbon Intensity from the House of Lords, uh, where we were able to stand up alongside other partners within industry and outside of industry to say, hey, we want to do something good here for society and this is it, we can help you.